Welcome, I'm Jason with Cerakote. Today we're going to walk through the procedure of changing the FANUC purge switch in your Cerakote robot. The tools required for this job are a 4 and 5 millimeter Allen wrench and your new FANUC purge switch. Begin by photographing the pneumatic lines going into the base of the robot. Proceed to depress the collar and remove them from their socket. Tuck the air hoses under the robot and out of the way. Utilize a 5mm Allen wrench or equivalent to remove all six screws from the base plate housing. Carefully remove the base plate from the base of the robot and pay careful attention not to tear the gasket. Swing the base plate out of the way. Do not tug on any of the electrical connections. Note the location of each connector before removing from the purge switch. Begin removal of the purge air exhaust with a 5mm Allen wrench. Carefully set the clamshell aside and use a 4mm Allen wrench to begin removing three of the four screws that retain the purge switch in the robotic housing. Support the purge switch by removing the final bolt. Beware of loose wires when removing the switch from the housing. Install the replacement switch into the robot and line up the first bolt. Install the last three bolts and hand tighten with an Allen wrench. Reinstall the exhaust clamshell and gently tighten with a 5mm Allen wrench. Reinstall the FS1 and FS2 electrical connections into the purge switch. Gently tuck the wiring harness up into the housing and reinstall the base plate. Gently thread all six bolts back into the base and hand tighten with a 5mm Allen wrench. Reinstall trigger one and trigger two, as well as the purge and robot supply pneumatic airlines. For proper orientation, refer to the original photograph taken at the beginning of the process. Thanks for watching. For more information, visit Cerakote.com and check out our other videos for more information on your Cerakote robot.